Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and welcome back to some more Dungeon Survival. Now, I restarted the game. We're going to be going through a new save, considering that we already finished like the tutorial and everything, and now that I know what I know, whoops, now that I move my mic, now that I know what I know, we can go in and have a little bit more fun. Let's see. Uh, we're going to throw the knees into you. Wait, actually, I'm going to take the Paladin. Because I remember playing last time, we had the Paladin, who was like, really useful. We're going to take in... Actually, yeah, we got our teams of Mythfists we can bring in. Uh, we didn't finish two for this. Hold on. Let's go in with you. Let's go in with you as second. So as our backup. Let's go in with you as our sniper. And we're going to take in... Let's take in you. Well, actually, we could take in the priest. Why not? Let's see how that goes. We got some damagers. Okay, right off the bat, we already found some enemies. So I told you guys we were probably going to do this as a series. And I was actually thinking about it real hard. I might as well do, you know... Do a series. If I get tired of it, I'll drop it, you know. And no reason to keep myself, you know. No reason to force myself to play like most of the games I play, you know. So now and then I might drop a series. But for now on, I'm probably going to start up a series that I actually enjoy now and then. I totally wanted to try this out just because I really enjoyed The Darkest Dungeon. So, you know, let's get into it and try it out. Plus, with all the things that the Darkest Dungeon had, this will definitely probably, well, more than likely make a good series to try out. I actually thought about going back to play the Darkest Dungeon. So it really depends on how this makes me feel. All right, found some shoes. What else? Nothing. All right, hold on. We found some gears. Let's go ahead and throw these on. So this, uh, it doesn't have a set to who it goes to, so we can just throw it on you. Go back here, throw this on you. I want our paladin to be very, very tanky. Alright, we still got the bleed on him. Jeez. I got all the poison effects. Alright, now we're doing decent damage. So the musketeer is like really, really strong. The paladin is actually pretty good. I enjoy the Paladin just because of the bleed. Didn't really use the Lancer too much on the second on the second account we had it there in the first impression. So yeah, now we we'll start using him a little bit more. Just a little bit, not too much though. Mostly because I'm not a huge fan of him not having like you know debuffs. I mean, he has a stun. That's one thing he has. Oh god, we got this guy. He's gonna hit us to the back. Ah, uh, yep, there we go. That's fine, we got plenty of time. I wanted to bring in the assassin, but for some reason, the assassins that I've seen start out without their uh, basic attack for some reason. It's weird. Like, all they have are their skills, and that doesn't help me at all for some reason. I just gotta say, it's it's weird. It's weird that they don't have their basic skills. Alright, there we go. Everybody's back in place. I wouldn't eat these because they they heal you, but they also poison you. So, yeah. And it seems like food travels with you between dungeons too so you guys saw that I had that apple once I get out of here I should still have that apple and it appears if you give um, whatever you give the priest she starts healing more so all of her damage is based on how much she heals or her or her heals are based on how much damage she has 
to see that. That's way easier. And it seems like every like item in the game are buffs. Because you guys know in a darkest dungeon, every item would have like their buffs and debuffs. Ah, uh, so there's some of the some of those like stats you guys can look at. So I definitely need to find a good weapon for. For some reason, we found everything for the paladin though. All right, let's get out of here. Everybody survived. Nobody acquired any bad debuffs. This guy required something. Prediction. Random event triggered an extra movement. So, in this game, depending on how your character comes out, he could get some debuffs or buffs. It's just like the Darkest Dungeon. You can come out with some bad things or you can come out with some good things. It's actually really annoying, so you gotta, you gotta keep your eye on it. Whoops, I was not trying to click that. Come back. God darn it, I clicked it again. I keep thinking that's like uh, this. Alright, we're actually gonna take that off of you just because I wanna see if we actually found. Ooh! Well, I was gonna say if we found a ninja, but we actually have a legendary paladin. What? Oh no, it's gonna. By the time we even get it, it's gonna disappear. So I'm kind of sad. Because if you guys don't know, this resets every three days. And three days are pretty much match days. Each time we embark, that's a day. And this even gives you how many days that pass. So that's not good for us. Oh no. I wonder if we can actually make that much before then. Hmm. Well, if it doesn't, then we'll we'll get an assassin at least. At least, hopefully, we can get an assassin. Give her that, and you take that. So yeah. Also, another way to heal your characters is bringing them inside of here. And Jesus Christ, her, her dialogue is so long. You can't skip it. You can't just click it, have everything on, on there, and just click it again and have it go away. You literally have to wait until she's done with her dialogue. But yeah, to heal, you bring in your mercenaries, throw them in here, and they stay in here for however many times or runs you go through. So it's pretty much like cycle through your, your mercenaries. So yeah, you can play as long as you want, but your mercenaries do have to heal. Um, the only problem is with this, it's just like the Darkest Dungeon. If, you're, if your people die, uh, it's not going to be a good day for you because multiple reasons. And the multiple reasons is if you run out of gold, you can't buy new allies. If you get to the point where you would have to restart your run, such as... If you're, all of your characters die, then that's just pretty much your shit out of luck. This does not go by actual days, so you can't just throw them in here and just be like, I'm just going to wait you know, a few days for them to heal. No. These days are by runs, so you're, you could be screwed and have to completely restart. So yeah, that hurts. That hurts a lot, actually. So you got to manage your characters and your runs like very well you gotta pick up any characters that you think it will like help you out so yeah bring a healer healers could probably be really good for this especially on start off just so you can save a little bit uh we're gonna switch you guys we're gonna hmm are we gonna take this team in well actually eh. Hold on, we're gonna we're gonna farm this a little bit more before we go into the next stage, because I want to try and get um, assassin for sure, because assassins with their bleed damage and everything that could also be useful. 
But you know what? Screw it. We're going to do this. Put you there. Put you there. We're going to take in you. Wait, no, no, not you. Why are you trying to join in? Get out of here. Jeez. It's like, ah, I want, I want to join in. <laughs> no, no, take, take me along. I can do this. Of course you can do it, more than likely, but we're not trying to take you in. Alright, let's see what we can do. So obviously any gear I'm gonna have to throw onto her. Ah, the whole movement thing is really annoying. As you guys can see, my hills are like way, way higher now. Just from giving her the gear. So we're gonna have to start heading things her way. Uh, let's finish you off. That guy is going to be really annoying for sure. Like, Assassin has really good things. That's why I want to bring one along. Like, he has a knockback to where he can just, just knock the first person all the way to the back. That seems like really helpful. Alright, let's keep killing. Try not to have anybody sent to the cemetery today, you know? Emphasis on trying. Oh, we out of an assassin book. I should have just waited then before I went in here. But then again, it's not like anything would have popped up inside of the mercenary. So I need to save gold every time just so I can have a chance of getting oh ooh, he dropped food just in case I have like a chance of getting another legendary just in case I miss this one oh, this is gonna be annoying I'm gonna get hit aren't I really dude come on don't be that guy don't don't be that guy please But obviously, the Darkest Dungeon has a lot more, like, <laughs> a lot more terrible things in this game. This one's kind of like a family-friendly one compared to that. Oh, we got, we got cheese. We got some more items. Oh, we got a helmet. What is this? We got HP. We got... Actually, hold up. Hey, pal, come back here. Let's throw stuff on our priest. Because she's definitely going to need it more than anyone. Especially if it gives, like, damage and healing. You can keep the rest of this stuff. Oh. This for priests? Take that off, then. Put this on. Okay, so yeah, it has heal. Never mind. Okay, I see, I see. So whatever says healing. Alright, that's... This increases healing, this HP and armor, so I can take this off, this off, and this off, and give this back to the paladin. This on the other hand, I'm going to give to you. I'm gonna go this way. Ah, there's the hill. Wow, I wish I definitely wish we were doing like way more damage though. A little bit more heal. All we gotta do is just find more healing items and she's just gonna be a complete badass. Oh, I thought you were dead, jeez.
more enemies here. Dude, that bleed is, like, really annoying. Yeah, we got a crit on that. And obviously you would hit me to the back. Thanks for that, jerk. So I'm gonna have to... Uh, I'm gonna have to use that too wisely. These guys are doing way too much damage. It's actually really bad. Alright, there we go. We're back in that safe formation. That's that's one reason why I didn't move him. Okay, so we're at the What else is there? Hold on. We might have to use this stuff. Removes poison effect. Ooh, okay. If that's the case, I'll just do this. Alright, so she's poisoned now. Oh yeah, she's poisoned for sure. Remove that poison effect. There we go. We got a little bit more HP back. Um, I don't think this is going to remove poison, so... Yeah. So we can't eat the other one that's downstairs. Alright, let's see... What else we got down here? Oh, we got a door. Got a book. Oh my god. Um, that icon is definitely a boss. Um... Fuck it. Let's go. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Um, dude, don't don't move me. Fuck off. Get stunned. All right, she does that. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be so bad. Okay, we gotta kill. We gotta kill. We gotta hurry. So if it's like the darkest dungeon, if you kill... Get that crap off. If you kill enemies and get them... To, well, if, yeah. If you kill them to a certain slot, they won't be able to use skills. So this guy seems like he really gets off on being in the back row. So he's probably a back row character. Let's see. Yeah, he can target anyone, actually. Oh, that's that's really annoying. Oh, he has this. Let's go ahead and kill. Let's try and kill as fast as we can. Okay, she's on death door again. Let's go ahead and heal. that oh no he summons back okay come on come on come on come on we got this we got this self him fuck you dude oh my god fuck you stop it oh my oh that's a that's a stun okay then are you kidding me Wins. Dead. Let's put some bleeds on him. Let's take that crap off. Oh my god, we actually went in with the right team. Uh, heal. He's gonna summon his minions again. That's the really annoying thing. Oh, I should have stunned. Okay, heal. Damage. Stun. Garrett's more health. Okay, okay, okay. Kill. Kill. Yes! We got it! <laughs> oh, thank god. And we got an assassin book, too. That helps us out so much. 
Okay, we're done. We can go back. Uh, I'll reach you guys later. What's this? Cell activation. Randomly removes... Ooh! Randomly removes poison or bleed. That's great to have on a paladin. What the hell? I can't believe we actually did that run. We beat our first boss in this game. Jeez. Yeah, they are definitely injured. For sure after that. I can't believe my musketeer held on that long. Like, she was at death's door every time. <gasps> wait, wait, is it? Is he still there? No, it reset it, dude, come on. We could have had it. Dude, that sucks. That really does suck. And this is what I mean about the assassin. For some reason, this is his basic right here. Wait, no, this is his basic. That requires no cooldown at all. And everything else here? Well, actually, hold up. Texas lowest eight. Oh, never mind. This is his lowest cool down. Oh, I thought there was this one. Okay. Oh, no. I had one that had this and this for some reason. So it's up to this or this. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. But it really does suck that we missed out on that Paladin for sure. But... Yeah, that, that sucks so much. The legendary paladin, and we missed out on it. That really does hurt. So now we can come in here buy food and books if we need them. So that's going to be good. Especially if we need a lot of skill books. So we can up the priest. Let's go ahead and buy the priest book. Why not? So you can go in with food food comes out with you from what I see this is for storing things um, also if you uninstall the game um, you lose all of your progress there is no actual saving to this game from what I can see you can do a daily share I think that's about it hold on yeah I think there's just a daily share of your progress there's not really much. Oh yeah, because like us on Facebook and stuff like that. So there is no saving your account here. Once you once you get off of it, it's it's over with. You can't really do anything else from that point. Which does suck because if you want to save your progress, you can save your progress. But I would recommend playing the Darkest Dungeon because you can actually save your progress on that game. <laughs> Even if, I guess, even if you're on the solid, maybe. But we have a paladin in here. Uh, nah, we, we're gonna get the assassin. We're gonna come over here. You gotta manage your gold pretty well, too, in, in this game. So this would go up in damage. Um, this would go up in heals. I want to increase this. So at level... Okay, she needs to be level 5 to increase more. Oh, I should have got that. Uh, okay, I'll find another book. We can also increase that for more damage. We can also increase the bleed effect. And plus we can absorb damage too. If we had a paladin book but we can't seem to find one but we do have an assassin book so we can go over here and get this bleed which I've been wanting okay get off my screen I'm trying to see this one okay so we have all the assassin skills now let's do one more run but we're gonna do it in here Actually, hold up. Let's go. Let's go heal our characters. And uh, we're just gonna heal them here. 
Okay, so it doesn't depend on how much HP they're missing. So I'm pretty sure once you put them in here, it doesn't matter of, like, how much... I don't think it, like, um... God, how do I... Excuse me. How do I, how do I say it? So... Huh, how would I say it? Oh, okay. So basically, if you put them in there, I don't think it costs, like, every day. I think it actually just heals you every day that it's in there. It doesn't, like, cost you, like, that much. As long as they're in there, they're healing. That's what I sh was trying to say. Now, let's bring in Demon Hunter. Let's see how this scene goes. Just because we can start... We can stock bleed damage with these two. Okay. Wait, does he have... Hold on. What does he have? Randomly attacks teammates. That's not good. Okay. Um, I should have read the crap he has. Okay, so this... So these two both have prediction. So that's good for them. This guy... He has these two. So he has quite a bit of buffs going on. So this could be our strongest character. Oh god, that crit. You can't control yourself? Well, you're gonna have to fucking control yourself, goddammit. Jeez. Be dangerous to our team if you're going to be doing that. Uh, you can discard items if you don't want to like carry all those. You have two slots, so yeah. I think there are items you can sell too. That's what I mean about the punchback he has. So we're actually going to run out of this dungeon after we're done with this and. Try and sell a few items. Because some items are useless to use. Or they have no use. Like I said, pretty much the darkest dungeon rules. Like this. This is pretty much selling the sacred stone. I don't, I don't know if it's used for anything, actually. I'm going to sell them just because they give us a lot of goat. Oh my god, I just realized it and I hate myself. I could have used the sacred stone just to get the legendary paladin. But my dumbass did not realize that until now. I hate myself. I honestly do. <laughs> oh no. How did I... Well, okay. You know what? I'm not going to dwell on it too often because I'm just going to keep triggering myself and pissing myself off now. Alright, heal yourselves more. Seems like everybody else is just fine for now. So she's, she's going to get her HP back. So this one, he attacks the lowest HP. So it's between... So it's between... Uh, one and third slots that he hits. He can't hit the back ones for low HP. Yeah, have fun healing each other. I'm gonna open this. And let's go down. Oh, you're just gonna turn away from us? That's really rude of you. Let's go ahead and stack some bleed on him. Let's heal you. Alright, so that does cut out the cooldown on it. What about this? Oh, the constant heal doesn't have a cooldown. So the paladin could also be a support afterwards, too. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see. Let's go ahead and 
Just keep doing this for her. Let's bring him in the front because he's gonna try and loop us. So that's a one that's one way to counter that. Alright, so we're on round four. Well, that's it for now. It's not really hurting us all that much. Alright, let's reset our formation. Nothing in that. So we robbed him for uh, Alchemist Stone. Wait, is there more enemies in here? Uh, yeah, there are more enemies in here, apparently. Flies, let's give you an apple. Yeah, we're just gonna give him a apple. He doesn't need any more than that, you know. everyone. If you out the way, uh, let's go ahead and aim for him. Try and kill him. Well, he's going to die to poison. Or to him. That works too. Oh, that counter though. Okay, I want to see how much damage it Oh, so that's, hold up, I'm curious how much damage you do now. Eh, better than your normal damage. Never push go back just because you could be missing a chest. And those chests can have important items in it. Still didn't find another shield though. But we did find another item with healing on it though. So this one gives seven healing, this one gives seven healing. Oh, this base just gives the same stats. Alright, so nobody got like any new debuffs or anything, so we're we're good. We are good. Yep. Ah, definitely could have had enough to get that fucking problem. I I hate myself. I honestly do. I hate myself with a passion just for that. Our Paladin definitely would have been very strong too in stats. But you know, you can't you can you can't win them all, you know. Probably could, you know, but I not gonna talk about it. I'm not gonna talk about it. Hold on. Um trying to get the oh, items, the So this one did have healing. Yeah, this has six healing. How the hell do you have that? I'm gonna give the shield to you. Rabies is actually gonna be really annoying. Concussion. Concussion is not gonna affect us too much. So, yeah, guys, with that done um hope you guys enjoyed and hopefully you guys can join me in a series of all this crazy crap that's going to be happening especially me fighting new bosses that does random crap and can kill all my units so yeah i hope to see you guys in the series if you guys want me to start off the darkest dungeon series instead um let me know because i had started it once i can start it up again but until then I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Sweet.
gonna get better real soon Don't let anyone tell you what you should do I got a clear view We're gonna make it soon Just keep pushing through Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through Cause what you got to lose?